We've all seen images of auto manufacturer assembly lines. Imagine a future where you see the same type of scene for large nuclear plant components rolling off an assembly line in a factory warehouse. One after another, components are rapidly produced and put together using advanced manufacturing and welding techniques. But it's not quite as simple or easy to put together nuclear generation components as cars and trucks. Assembly of these heavy components require thick section welds that with traditional methods are typically slow, labor intensive, and require inspections throughout the life of the component. Engineers at EPRI, the Nuclear Advanced Manufacturing Research Center, and New Skill Power, in collaboration with the United States Department of Energy, are exploring new ways of assembling and welding together heavy pressure vessels. The research is looking at electron beam welding, a proven method used for decades on small, thin section components, and innovating the technique for large, thick section components. Unlike the existing traditional arc welding technologies that can often take days or weeks to complete and include numerous weld passes, electron beam welding is a single pass process that doesn't require the addition of filler metal, reducing the weld time to minutes. The process is performed in a controlled factory environment. It starts by placing components in a large vacuum chamber the electron beam gun generates a focused, high-powered stream of electrons into the mating joint between two components, melting the materials, creating a fused assembly in a single weld pass. EB welding provides distinct advantages. It's about 10 times faster than traditional arc welding, providing considerable cost savings. The heat affected zone is minimal due to the reduced heat input. Since filler metals aren't required, certain heat treatments are employed to optimize the alloy's grain structure, restoring the factory toughness comparable to that of the base material. This also eliminates the issues with filler metal embrittlement seen in the past with conventional welding techniques. Effectively removing the presence of the weld potentially eliminates the need for costly in-service inspection and reduces outage times and worker exposures. After proving the technology in laboratory environments, the Nuclear AMRC is leading electron beam welding activities in this collaborative project. Our team is working to manufacture a representative two-thirds scale small modular reactor using electron beam welding. Advanced manufacturing techniques like PM, HIP, and electron beam welding are the types of game-changing technologies that will be used to manufacture future nuclear components. Electron beam welding is one of many game-changing innovations we are investigating to address the most urgent challenges facing the sustainability of nuclear power generation. Other major thick section components can also benefit from reduced assembly times, including pressurizers, steam generator shells, headers, valves, turbine discs, etc. And stay tuned to learn more about the work EPRI is leading to scale up EB welding to even larger components using a modular vacuum chamber approach. With success of these projects, the nuclear industry will be even better poised to meet society's energy demands.